there guys and gals, Rob here with Deluxe Gaming, and welcome back to Gladiator School. And on the last episode, we faced the tragic, heartbreaking moment of losing our mighty champion, Gladiator Slurker, who had a total wins of 22, but the dude got hit hard. As a matter of fact, it was the crowd that decided his fate. They actually gave him a thumbs down at the end, and he was slain. It was so terrible. But on the bright side, we sort of learned what we're going to need for the uh, for the Bronze League in order to, to get in there. It's, it's tough, man. It's tough. These guys are brutal. But anyway... Anyway, we get a constant reminder of that defeat right here. He will uh, sit there. We, we get to pray to him every once in a while and go, oh, Slurker, yeah, whatever. Anyway, so I have some good news, though. I have some really good news. There's been a brand new patch for Gladiator School, which opens up a few things that are what more than welcome things that i've been actually talking about the last few episodes so under actions now we can actually feed our guys right on the main menu here so much easier than going up to that gladiators the whole gladiator uh, menu there that's just so much easier i can just click that and boom they feed them isn't that nice oh that's great i love that we can also send them to bed here which is very very convenient again we don't have to go to that gladiator screen we can promote them to a champion i wonder what happens so it automatically defaulted dimrock fur as our champion dimrock fur is is not is not our best warrior uh, what is he at? He is at uh, health 40, stamina 22, and damage 2. Whereas Betterman is 232, uh, 256, and 39. So we definitely want Betterman to be our champion. So I wonder if... Can we make two champions? Oh, so we, oh, we're, we've we got two champions. Look at that. Oh, that's kind of cool. So Dimrock Fur and Betterman are our champion? Oh, no. Okay, so we took out the outfit. Okay, so he threw, he threw the clothes out. And he's like, I don't want this. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to be the champion. Also, two new commodities in the game. There is cakes and wine. So cakes, I believe, are a reward that you give to your champions as and also an alternate food. So I believe it probably boosts mood as well as feeds your feeds your guys. Although I can't imagine a gladiator living on cake and doing very well in the long term. But I, I don't know. It's an option. I don't know how that's going to work. And you can also give your guys wine to boost their morale because nothing says uh, fighting competently like getting them drunk so you can actually buy wine from the market let's go see how much that costs um so it is uh let's see here wine is 20 for 250 wine and uh oh, sorry 20 20 wine for 250 gold and cake is 20 for 100 gold so it's it's not that expensive in the grand scheme of things looks like we got paid out a little bit of money for um uh, for the loss of our gladiator, as well as one of the another thing that's in this patch is uh, when you start a new game, you start out with 25 more wood than you did before. So I'm wondering if they just paid out some of that money as part of our save game. That's possible, and that's kind of cool. We have 1458 to spend, and I'm not sure how we're gonna spend that money quite yet. But we definitely need to get Betterman trained up better than what he is, because there's no way that he's going to survive in the long term with the stats that he has. Slurker was far better than him. Actually, that's not entirely true. Betterman has one distinct advantage. Benderman has um, gear. He has a bonus of... Oh, hold on. That's a Benderman. There we go. Benderman, Benderman has a plus six bonus to damage off the top just from doing some of the battles that he did. Uh, he just got some bonus damage, which is nice because as you train on these machines, it, gets, it takes longer and longer and longer to get good at what you're doing, right? So it's just six bonus damage over and above what you see here, I believe. Maybe that's included. I'm not sure. But I think it's over and above this damage rating right here. Um, another thing we're going to be doing is we're not going to be sleeping anymore. Sleeping's for chumps. <laughs> gladiators. You know, gladiators in my school, no sleep until you become a champion and really, really tough in battle. That's it. I'm tired of these guys just, you know, sleeping all the time. Every night. Every night they do it. Can you believe it? The nerve of sleeping every single night. <laughs> Something else that is new for the game in this patch is the Medicus. So the Medicus, of course, treats injuries and recover health using medical herbs. If you have medical herbs, I believe you, use, you can use a Medicus. Otherwise, you can just uh, send your guys to go sleep on one of the medical beds, which is kind of cool, and they will recover their wounds faster. I'm not sure exactly how that works. I guess we're going to find out when one of our guys gets injured. Um, we might, what we could do, actually, just to kind of test that out, we could get, stop him from doing that. Let's, uh, let's pit Unknown Ninja versus uh, Dimrock Fur in our little pit and maybe one of them will get injured and we can send them to, off to the medical room that'll be kind of cool all right here we go so the this this little training arena i believe they get uh, stamina and damage experience doing this but they run the chance of of course getting injured and uh, i think you can knock them unconscious or something too it's kind of cool so yes yeah, so he just got one damage point they're getting stamina too speed this up a little bit uh i want to be sure that they're getting i don't know if they get stamina points they just get oh yeah no they get stamina points as well so let's go back to regular speed i don't want them to knock <laughs> knock each other out did somebody get injured here nobody got injured really 
Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, you guys go take a rest. But yeah, if you get injured, I believe you can just send them off to the medical bed to go rest now. That's kind of cool. Oh, Betterman. Uh, okay, hold on. We're going to build you another bath. And then Betterman can go rest in the bath because Betterman is, uh, is having a rough time right now. We need to get his health up to about 500 Maybe even higher? I don't know. These Bronze League guys are way tougher than what I expected. Way tougher. So, yeah, we're going to have to do something more serious than what we've done so far. Oh, Unknown Ninja. So, yeah, I love that we can now feed our guys through our main menu here. Look at that. Isn't that great? Can we just go along and feed everybody? And if they're full already, I don't know if they'll eat. They might. I think they actually say uh, already full or something. So, that's kind of cool. Demarc Fur, let's get you... Uh, these three guys are going to be champions eventually. We're going to get them all trained up. I think it, the key here is just making sure that they just spend as much time on these machines as possible. As a matter of fact, what we might do eventually is build three of the same machines up top here because we're gonna we're gonna get some more gladiators here. Uh, maybe tomorrow. The only time we're gonna sleep now is when the day before a fight. That's it. <laughs> no, no sleeping otherwise. I'm tired of the sleeping. These lazy bums sleeping every night. I just it's not gonna happen anymore. No more. No more rest for these guys. No more rest for the wicked. We need to get, uh, I think his damage, we need, we need to get him up to like 60 or 70 damage if, if he's going to compete and he needs to get some skill points. I'm wondering, so how many skill points? He's only got two right now. He's got, uh, he's got weapon mastery only. We need to get power strike and dodge or power strike and combo attack or all three of them. Man, he just needs to get into that ring as much as possible. So, you know what? He can have a rest tonight. Everybody can have a rest. I, I changed my mind. They can all sleep tonight. That's it. <laughs> the thing is, actually, these two guys, I shouldn't have sent these two guys to sleep. They should just train through the night. The only person that needs sleep at night is a guy that's going to be fighting in the ring, right? Because otherwise you take that big damage uh, damage hit. You just don't do as much damage, so that's unfortunate. We should buy another gladiator. Uh, we'll do it in the morning. We can't go to the market right now anyway. <laughs> we can only do so much at once. It looks like they've added a few other things in here. See, we've got storage boxes in here. That's kind of cool. Um, it looks like, oh, this is where our cake goes. Oh, cool. Cake and wine. Oh, cool. So they, they end up in here, too. Oh, that's really neat. So, yeah, that's cool. I like that. <laughs> I'd like to see more torture more torture stuff in the torture chamber here. That'd be kind of fun. Add a little bit of flavor. So, Benderman, let's get you fed. Actions. Feed. Let's get the other guys training for now. It doesn't matter what they do. Benderman, let's get you into the ring. And, oh, there's been a change with the rings, too. So with the pit fights, um, let's do a... Let's just do the simple fights, because we can do multiples of these right now. Uh, one, one after the other. So one of the things they've done, oh, Atius the dog, uh, the, the, the developer of this game, I love the developer. He's listening. It's like, it's like he's watching my videos and listening to what I'm saying because, uh, yeah, he took, he took, uh, our latest recommendation. The one thing I've been saying the last couple episodes and added a fast forward button for the combat. So watch this. So we go and look at that. Isn't that great? Boom, boom, boom. And done. Lovely. So Sometimes you're just doing these basic battles just one after the other because you just have a lot to do and, you know, to get the skill points and, of course, for a little bit of extra money. So you're just doing these in bulk. I, I wish it was a little bit, few less steps to get into the ring here. But uh, at least, at the very least, there is a fast forward button making this go by a ton faster. Um, Ju Juventius the Traitor. So basically, this is just where we execute people, essentially. <laughs> Getting a little bit of experience points every single time that we go in here. A little bit of money. Um, really nice. Uh, let's do our third one here. Uh, we could... I, I'm still kind of chicken about doing the next level of fights with Betterman. Betterman is... Betterman needs a lot more training, but he can do, certainly do these one after the other and get a whole bunch of... A uh, whole bunch of money and a whole bunch of experience. And this is Servius the Outlaw. <laughs> Servius, meet your doom. Oh, wow. Uh, Betterman, don't just stand there. Actually, fight. Dude. <laughs> oh, good. He blocked to the right spot. Oh, Betterman, uh, Betterman tends to play a little bit more defensively, just in general. But anyway, awesome. Good. And he got some... Oh, wicked. So we got another two damage points. Fantastic. That's great. Okay, Benderman, how are you doing for stats here? Let me just see. Oh, stop moving. Benderman, you need... Do you need rest? Uh, you do. Okay, go get some rest. So now we're just going to have Benderman train for the next uh, two days. And we can't afford to buy a brand new gladiator. That I'm excited about. And I think what we're going to do this time is we're going to buy the high quality stock. These slaves were born to fight and have a huge potential to become great gladiators. Thousand bucks. Thousand bucks, guys. Ooh, look at him. He looks awesome. Drusius has arrived at your school. We're going to rename him, though. Drusius. Drusius the champion. Uh, Mood terrible. Let's get him in the pool for now. So he's got... Holy crap. He starts with 500 health. Um... 
I'm never buying a regular gladiator again. 500 health! Holy crap, stamina 50, damage 25. So he does need some training in all of these areas, but health is, wow, that's a, that's a nice, that's nice to start out with that much health. That is really nice. Betterman, let's get you on uh, on the weight training here. Because Betterman, look at him. He's, we've been training him the whole game. He's still only at 250 health. Wow, that's crazy, man. That is crazy. Dimrock for you might as well go sit on the damage machine for now. So let's fast forward or go as fast as we can here for a few days. Just do some hardcore training. Benjamin, I want to get him back into the pit tomorrow, though, because uh, he needs he needs more of those skill points. Skill points, he's got five. So uh, actually, one of the things I noticed here, if we go to the market, we can buy skill points. Uh, general goods. We can buy for a thousand bucks. We can buy 10 skill points. So why don't we start doing that? I think that's a really good idea. 10 skill points. It's a thousand bucks, but you know what? We throw them in the pit a little bit every day, Betterman, and we'll have that thousand bucks in no time. And then we, of course, we could have a... Dru Hold on. We've got to rename Drusius. What am I doing here? Rename Drusius. Your name shall henceforth be... Uh, what do we got here? We've got... Uh... <laughs> okay. You are going to be Skywalker. Uh, whoop, not Skywalker. Wow, Skywalker. There we go, Skywalker. Welcome to the team, Skywalker. Fantastic. You, he has some glorious scars already, which is nice. Too bad you can't get scars in these bit, you know, in these big fights where you get injured and stuff. Get some scars or go cross-eyed because you get hit too hard on the head. That would be great. That would be lovely. Let's make sure that he has a bed, Skywalker. Assign him the bed, and oh, can we upgrade the beds? Uh, okay, I thought maybe for a second we could upgrade the beds. It doesn't do anything. So maybe later on you can upgrade the beds or something. I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, Skywalker, uh, how are you doing for stats? Oh, uh, you're good. Let's get you on a machine finally. And uh, on non ninja you can go take a rest. Yes, having having more than two pools is, is a really good idea. We might even go for four pools. And I think one of the things we're also going to do is we need to buy a little bit of wood. What do we... How much... It's 15 wood in a lot, right? So let's go to market. Oh, it's, it's nighttime already. That's fine. Uh, go really fast. Um, we're going to train... We're going to have Benderman go rest. Actions. Or, ben, you know, I don't know. I don't know what the right answer is. Benderman, should we should we send you to bed? Yeah, let's send you to bed. Skywalker, you can train through the night. Okay. Uh, Dimrock Fur, let's get you on the weightlifting machine. On Un Ninja, you might as well just uh, continue to train. We need to actually... You know what we need to do? We need... Because on Un Ninja... Dimrock Fur, Skywalker, and Betterman are going to be our four guys that we're going to make sure that get into battles at some point in time. So maybe, although, I don't know, Anna Ninja, no, you know what? Anna Ninja, you are going to be going back to doing just uh, janitorial work. Although, I I don't know. I don't know what the right answer is. He's got 94 stamina, which is substantial. All he's got to do is work on his health and damage. But yeah, we need to clean the place up. Anna Ninja, you got to do some janitorial work. Uh, Dimrock Fur, wow, okay, you, uh, you burned through that stamina very quickly. Skywalker, you too. Let's get you back in the pool and fast forward. Yay, day 24. Benderman, let's get you a bite to eat. Feeding Benderman. Let's get him into the pit as quickly as possible. Um, Tavern. I wonder, let's do something a little bit tougher for Benderman. Let's go to the Vanasho. And Benderman, you're going to fight a beast, a wild beast, a lion. Because we want money now. I want money more than anything else. And I think we can sustain a couple of these fights, maybe. 205, 87. Wow, look, he's got lots of stamina, but uh, he's only got two. Wow, this is actually a way closer fight than I expected. <laughs> oh, boy. I think we'll still win it, though, because the lines don't block, right? We just we just need to apply as much damage as possible to the lines. I don't think they block anyway. How does a line block? He, like, puts his paws up and crosses him or something. Roar! <laughs> I guess we'll go fast forward here, sure. <laughs> Yeah, so I can block, but he can't block. So that actually makes this fight a little bit easier for me, I suppose. I, I think Benderman can do some of the regular... Oh, we got more skill! Another two points! Oh, fantastic. Let's get him back in the pit. The pits, let's just do easy fight. Gladiator, get some more skill and money. Benderman, there we go. And we could probably do two of these uh, to finish off the day for him. We'll go fast forward. I love the fast forward button, but it's still a lot of steps to get into the ring. You notice that? Like, there we go. Because... Fight super fast, but now we got to go through the whole process of coming back here, going back to the market. Whoops, going back to the uh, tavern, going back to the pit, and then click on the pit, then pick the guy, and then pick the guy to go in. It's a lot of steps to get in here. I'd like to have fewer steps, like quick fight or something. Like a button that's just quick, quick pit fight. Since the developer may be actually watching my videos. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've, oh yeah, he's good for one more fight, I think. We'll, we'll give him a little pep talk next time. 
I think he probably needs to eat too, so let's give him a bite to eat and let's get him back into the pit. Pit fights, a range fight, gladiator, Benderman, and continue. Yeah, he's a little low in stamina, so we'll give him a little bit of a pep talk this time. Pep talk, no pressure, no pressure. Oh, unmotivated. Oh, <laughs> whoops. <laughs> okay, oh, I think, I don't know. <laughs> All right, he can handle this, no problem. We still do tons of damage compared to these guys. 49, 41 damage versus his 10. We'll be able to beat this guy, no problem. Couple hits, he's down. We're a little low on stamina, but that's okay. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if we lost to this guy? It's possible. This there, It seems like they defend and attack totally random, so I suppose it's possible. Oh, we let him live this time. That's nice. Good money, easy money. So we're already at back over a thousand bucks. That's actually really great. Betterman, you need to go take a little bit of a break. You did a really good job today. Dimrock Fur, let's get you, uh, let's feed you and get you onto the damage machine, I guess, for now. Because Dimrock Fur is actually, yeah, he's, he's getting up there. He's got 140 health. He's doing pretty good. Uh, Skywalker, let's get you onto the stamina machine. We need to get, uh, everybody's stamina needs to be much higher than what it's been so far because I'm noticing, even with, even with the easy fights, they are running out of stamina because they're stupid. <laughs> because they're really, really dumb. They block when they shouldn't block, and that eats up their stamina. Although blocking is good, I can't complain about them blocking. Yeah, you know, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. I, I, st I just, you know, I kind of wish they wouldn't block so much. Um, Doom Rock for oh yes. Okay, uh, maybe maybe we'll do some more uh, fights. I'm not Ninja versus Doom Rock for because that's always fun to watch. <laughs> I, I will let them knock one of them out too this time. That'll be kind of fun. I, I wonder if you could actually kill one of your friendlies uh, doing that too. That's possible. Skywalker, go take a break. Unknown Ninja, uh, it's time for you to pit yourself against Dimrock Fur. Let's get him out. And Unknown Ninja, you can stop doing that. Get you in the pit. And Dimrock Fur, go in the pit. There we go. Fight. Betterman. Wow, his health is going up really slow. Like, really slow. It's taking a long time to get up there, man. We need to get it up to like five, six hundred in order to face those, the big guys, right? I mean, we've so long to go, so far to go. I'm definitely not buying any more of the cheap guys. Ah, oh, uh, non, non ninja got knocked out. Is he injured? Oh, oh Dimrock Fur is injured. Oh, that's kind of interesting. All right, well, Dimrock Fur, you can go rest. Unknown ninja, can we'll just send you to bed? Can we do that? Send to bed. There we go. <laughs> kind of fun, though. Kind of fun. Uh, Bitterman, you're going to train through the night tonight. Uh, Skywalker, let's get you back on the damage machine. And, uh, yeah, Sky Skywalker Skywalker definitely needs more damage. He needs more stamina, needs more damage, maybe even more health. I don't know. Betterman needs everything. Betterman still has so far to go before he's actually, you know, competent enough to deal with the bloody guys in the in the Bronze League. The Bronze League's too... I think you're... The, the first guy in the Bronze League is just too tough. I think. I don't know. He was, he was so tough. We were so close to winning that fight. So bloody close. Like, it was... We it, one more hit and we would have won it. I'm I'm gonna stew on this one because and then the crowd betrayed the crowd betrayed poor Slurker and and sentenced him to death. Like how tragic is that? Slurker Slurker was doing so well. He was undefeated up to that point, but I guess all it takes is once to get defeated and then you're done, right? Jim Rockford, you might as well come back out, do some more stamina training. Better let's get you on that machine, man. You need to get that health up. You know, maybe maybe we should do the stamina training, get all their stamina training done first, and then he'll just be able to stay on this machine longer. But Benjamin, we need to get him in... Or, I'm actually, we'll get Skywalker in the pits tomorrow. That's a good idea. We'll get Skywalker in the pits tomorrow so Benjamin can just keep training. We need a little bit more money. We're going to buy our skill points. That's what we're going to do, folks. We're going to buy our skill points. We're going to buy our weight. We're going to buy our success. <laughs> we're going to do like the rich do and buy our success. You need a bite to eat for sure. Benjamin, you need a bite to eat probably. You need a bite to eat. We're still good for food. we got lots of food kicking around. Um, Skywalker, you need to take a little bit of a break. Skywalker's going to be resting in bed tonight. Benjamin's going to train through the night, man. He's... We've got to do it. He has the most, he's got some distinct advantages. He's got those extra little points of damage that he has uh, just from going into those fights before, like the superior weapon strength and stuff like that, whatever it is. So we need to, we need to make sure that he is good to go as our champion. Oh, there we go. Go rest. Skywalker, let's get you back on the stamina machine. We're going to focus on stamina for you for a bit. Maybe stamina around 100 might be good. I don't know, because they are running out of stamina because they're dumb. <laughs> I guess I guess it's important to block, but when they block every single move, I don't know. Especially when when the enemy is like has no stamina whatsoever, there's no point in blocking because they're they're just gonna pass. That's when you attack, right? So having a little bit more control, maybe maybe setting their stance. I know we can set them as aggressive and passive and stuff, but 
I don't know if that really works the way we think it is, or think it does. I don't know. Uh, Dimrock Fur, let's get you. Actually, Dimrock Fur, I want you over here. Benderman, I want you on this machine. Skywalker, you're going to sleep through the night. Uh, send to bed. There we go. Unknown Ninja, how are you still cleaning? What's your deal, dude? Oh, yeah, you're cleaning. Okay. Um, how's your stats? Oh, you're fine. You're good. Skywalker, you're a good mood. You're going to be great for the pits tomorrow. Dimrock, let's get you sleeping. Wow, these guys... He needs, yeah, he needs stamina too. We need to get him on the stamina machine for sure. On on Ninja, you know what? Uh, let's throw you on the damage machine. Let's throw Dimrock Fur on this during the night. Sure. Get you guys doing some more training. It's going to take forever. To do. Maybe I should just leave these guys doing the the mundane duties of the, the, the school, like cleaning and stuff, because it's going to take so long to get them up to par. Like, so long. I wish we could send them away to, like, some kind of, I don't know, gladiator school? <laughs> or, like, some kind of weight training or something? I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Like, away from the school so it doesn't take so long here. Some way to speed up that process. All right, let's get you in the pit there, Skywalker. Um, let's see how well you do. Let's see how well you do. No, 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 no. We're not going to do these. Uh, we're going to do the regular pit fights for now. Because, yeah, we can just do more of these in a row without any worry of any any problems, right? It's just so much easier. There we go. First fight for Skywalker. Use the Force. I had to say it. I had to say it. I'm probably going to say it again one more time. But, yeah, use the Force, Skywalker. <laughs> I had to say it. I had to say it. All right. Uh, let's go back. Tavern. Pit fights. Easy. There we go. Done. Skywalker. Do it. Enter! There's got to be a faster way to do that whole process. Because if you're doing this in bulk, because sometimes you have to, um, yeah, there's got to be a faster way to do that. All right. Oh, he had combo attacks. Oh, two combo attacks in a row. Three combo attacks in a row? Good blocking, though. Good blocking on Skywalker's part. Good job. Just kill him, though, dude. Just, just, just kill him. <laughs> okay. See, now there's no reason for him to be, for uh, our guy to be blocking anymore because the guy has no stamina. Just attack and kill him. Why is he? Oh, this is this is brutal. This is painful. Skywalker, come on, man, hit him. What? <laughs> what is going on? Why is he not attacking? Attack, Skywalker. Um, what the? What? <laughs> what? Come on, just attack, Skywalker. There we go. Wow, that was painful. <laughs> Well, we made another couple hundred bucks. We've got enough to buy that one potion now. Dimrock Fur, let's get you in here. Skywalker, you definitely need to rest because that was terrible. That was shameful, actually. Benjamin, you need to rest as well. Um, how's your stats coming along? Oh, you're up to 430. You're getting up there now. Let's go to the market. We're going to buy the blue herbal tea for a thousand bucks. How do we use that? Oh, we've got it right here. Oh, okay. So, Benjamin, can you just, uh, how do we use it? How do we use the blue herbal tea? Hold on, pause. Let's go. I think we have to do it in the gladiators menu. Ah, there we go. Yes. Uh, no, 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 no. Bannerman. So now he should have 10 more skill points. Yes. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, that's great. So you just, you just got to make the money, right? So should we wait and get combo attack now? Or we could just do, I like power strike too. Let's go for dodge. For now, he definitely needs more points, so we'll get him. Uh, we'll, we just gotta keep, we just gotta keep pounding away. It is a little bit of a grind. This game, it's actually a big grind. This game is a super huge grind, man. I tell you, it's 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 just a lot of just waiting. There needs to be a fast. So there's regular speed fast. There needs to be super fast and maybe ultra fast, and then skip day, and then and then show me what happens next week button. You know, like there needs to be some 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 more intense buttons there. I think. Skywalker, Benderman, let's get you back on the weight training. Skywalker, um, we need to get you back on stamina because you were an idiot in your fight this last time and you ran out of stamina for some reason. Very, very bizarre. Um, all right, let's go fast. Man, it keeps slowing us down there. Okay, so Dimrock Fur, actually, let's get Unknown Ninja in the pool. Dimrock Fur, you might as well get on here. We should buy some more wood and get, uh, and get some more machines here because... There's going to be times where we want both Benjamin and Skywalker to work on health, or Benjamin and Skywalker to work on damage, for example. So I think that'd be really important. But right now, I'm more focused on getting those skill point potions, because that's huge, man. That's huge. Uh, Benjamin is, is getting up there now. Benjamin's he's up to 450, but he still needs 
I, he's, I would like to get him at least one more potion, maybe get him into a couple more fights too. Maybe we'll get both Betterman and Skywalker. Well, after, actually, everybody, everybody's sleeping tonight. Everybody's sleeping tonight. We're just gonna we're just gonna hit the rings like crazy tomorrow. Make as much money as possible. Maybe get another potion for Benderman. Yeah. Uh, Skywalker. Okay, well, Benderman's up to 460 health, so he's still got a ways to go, and he still needs some more damage. Still needs some stamina. Yeah, we still need lots of stuff. Man, we could buy potions for that too, but uh, <laughs> it's expensive. Gotta make money. Lots of money. Okay, come on, nighttime. There needs to be a button to say end night. There has to be a button for that. Unless there's random events that can happen at night, but even in that case, it should just skip to that random event, right? Because sitting here staring at the screen while they sleep is, is about as exciting as, you know, watching anybody sleep. It's not exciting at all. So that needs to be fixed. But otherwise, I, I'm liking the changes that they made. I'm not complaining because uh, they really did some uh, good things, I think, overall in the last uh, in the last patch here so let's go hold on let's go to actions let's uh, feed everybody not hungry skywalker have you eaten yet yeah you ate okay let's get to the pits oops tavern hello tavern pit fights easy you know what uh, let's go to normal let's do the venatio for both of them uh, let's try skywalker in the venatio i think he can handle it you can handle it dude you can totally handle it as a matter of fact we'll go tactics we'll go aggressive and pep talk, no pressure. I, I don't think that's necessary, but we'll do it anyway. 150 bucks for this fight. Let's go as fast as we can. Mr. Bear is going to die. The nice thing about Skywalkers is, is you can flip around that health into damage pretty easily, and I, I don't feel bad about that because he's got so much. But you know what? The, the guys in the Bronze League, they are super tough. I think they, I mean, what, the guy had like 500 health or something or 400 health? So me having, Skywalker having 500 health is like nothing to be that proud of. Like, come on, Skywalker, attack, dude. There we go. Jeez, painful. Oh, cool, he got improved weapon. Awesome, fantastic. Travel, travel home. And let's get back there and go pit fights. And we're gonna go normal fight, Venatio, and this is gonna be for Benderman. So cool 300. Oh, he's fighting an elephant. That's cool. Um, pep dog, no pressure, no pressure, unmotivated. Why is he unmotivated? What? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. How did he get unmotivated? Go aggressive. No need to block with the, or no need to, uh, they don't block. So just keep attacking, actually. this I wouldn't block. During these fights, if I had a choice, I just wouldn't block. I guess. I don't know. Because all the, uh, they don't do anything other than attack, right? So you're better off just attacking them until they're dead. Ooh, got a special hit there. That was kind of cool. All right, dead. Good job, Betterman. Let's get you back home and let's keep going. Fight after fight, guys. A little bit of uh, repetition here, but you know, we got to do what we got to do. We'll just do regular gladiator fights. Skywalker, you can do it. This guy's cross-eyed. Cortis the Executioner, his, his cross-eyed. Um, should be a pretty easy fight. Wow, you're down 252 health. So when you swap your health, like when you do go an aggressive stance, it actually removes that entirely for the day. It's interesting. Okay, so we, he can handle one more fight for sure. Go back and go through the process of clicking through all of these bloody menus, which drives me crazy. And there we go, Skywalker. One more fight. Come on, Skywalker. You can do it. You can do it. Go fast. Metius the Impure. I love the names. The names are so great. Metius the Impure. Uh, one more hit, he's dead. There we go. Perfect. And we're going to make some serious dough here. Oh, we got some more. Oh, sturdy. Awesome. We got some more skill points. Fantastic. And then, Benderman, we're going to get you back in the pits. Yes, I know we're doing a lot of this, but we've got to do it. It's uh, This is how we get our skill points and we get our money so that we can get even more skill points. Uh, just go ahead and fight. We, Benderman's got at least two, maybe three fights in him, too. <laughs> just one after the other. I wish you could just say... It would be kind of cool. Once you get to a certain point, you just say, do five of these fights. Actually, we shouldn't even be able to do these fights one after the other. What gladiator, what what ring is going to say, bring in your guy that we know is going to kill anybody that we put in front of him? Like, seems like seems like a little bit of an unfair thing that we, almost, it seems too good to be true in one way, but a pain in the butt in the other, like that we can just keep redoing this fight. I'm, I'm enjoying it. Like, it's fine that we're making all this extra money and stuff, but uh, uh, yeah, this is probably Benjamin's last fight for today. Last fight for the day. It'd be nice when we start doing some of the bigger fights, I think. We'll make more money per fight rather than just doing quantity of fights. You know what I mean? Be better. Good job, Betterman. Good job. So now let's go home. We've got 979. Ah, oh, not quite enough. 
All right, Skywalker, hold on. Let's go get some rest, Skywalker. Benjamin, go get some rest. I wonder if we can do even more fights today. Because if we do one more fight today, we can get one more skill point booster. Tim Rockfur, you might as well do some uh, some stamina training. <laughs> we're, we're, we're out of time. We're totally out of time. I was kind of hoping to get to another Bronze League fight this time, but we, we did get some cool stuff. Um, we learned a couple things, and those, those skill point potions are awesome. We definitely want to take advantage of those uh, for the future. Benjamin, let's get you back on this. And Skywalker, let's get you back on the damage machine. Ladies and gentlemen, that's all the time I have for you today. We'll be back in a few more days. Possibly, probably not tomorrow. Probably Sunday? I don't know. We'll see. Sunday or Monday, we're going to be back with another episode of Gladiator School. It's it's a little bit of a, a grind, guys. And I might start to fast forward some of the grindy stuff so that we don't have to, you guys don't have to endure all of this. Uh, just to make the, 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 the episodes run a little bit smoother. But I'm still loving this game. Loving all the changes that they made recently on this last patch. And uh, we'll see you next time. All right. Take care. Bye-bye.